Hey folks, it's Gary from Nova Scotia Ag Fisher Outdoors. Uh, no, it's been a while. I've had some uh, laptop issues, some camera issues, and I uh, lost a lot of footage. So uh, I know it's been a while since the video, so uh, just getting out today for a short video. I'm going to do a little snowshoeing and uh, set a couple snares and uh, see how that goes and uh, test out this new GoPro camera. And uh, then uh, we should have a video up for you soon. So uh, anyway, I've uh, been asked to give a few tips on uh, how to uh, set snares. So I'll try to get a few of those in there today, set some snares and then come back tomorrow and, uh, and check them. So stay tuned. Well, snowmobiles come down through here, so that should make for relatively easy snowshoeing. Okay, so Okay, so what we have here is a nice little heavily beaten down rabbit trail. And it splits in two over there a little bit, so I may put two snares here just to cover my bases. But uh that's what you're looking for. Uh it snowed on a we had a rather big snowstorm. We had a rather big snowstorm uh, last Monday and today's Thursday, so gave a few days of uh, cold weather and snow so they could, uh, so the pass would really show up to me. So came in today. Uh, I know they've been running the past few nights, uh, getting down the negative 15 Celsius range, so it's been cold enough. So uh, should find some good pass like this one uh, today. So uh, we'll. Uh, set up a snare and see how we make out. Okay, so we want to cover our bases here, so... This is an older snare that I've had before, so... May warm up a bit today, so let me just put a little stick there to try to keep the chin up. And then another one right here. All right, well, we got that path relatively covered. That should work out, should get a rabbit there tomorrow. So one of the reasons why I didn't bring the dog today is because I came up in here and some of my lost footage is uh, had some uh, encounters with porcupines and uh, I see up ahead of me here, if you look way up, there's Mr. Pine right there looking up at us, or looking down at us I should say. Hello Mr. Pine. Got that tree chewed up pretty good. Oh. So that's not all that encouraging. I know they're around, but when I see them, it always makes me a little nervous about bringing the dog into a spot. So 
Anyway, we'll move on and see if we can find some uh, rabbit trails. So I have a decent little path here. Uh, the first thing you want to do is find a, a stick. I prefer like an alder or something like that. So I've got my stick. I'll grab a snare here somewhere. So you want to make a nice loop in your snare wire. No kinks down in. I go with something like that if that shows up. And wrap it around your stick a couple times. Tie it off. Spot to put it down in place. The rabbit is running before, preferably. Okay, so we'll just get that centered a bit. That should be pretty good, but it's a little high and the snow could settle through the day a little bit. So I just grab a little stick, a little chin up stick. then uh, maybe one more stick on this side just uh, make them okay so here's a really good path it's been well used by the looks so we're going to stick a snare on. Let's see if we can find a good spot. You want to stay off the trail. But if you look in there, there's a nice choke point. That's just a dandy spot for a snare. So I'm just wrapping this snare a few times around this twig. I'm going to keep that down out of the way. Good wrap and I try to wrap it back over the top of itself a little bit. It doesn't have to be super tight. She'll tighten up when rabbit hits it. That should secure it. And make sure I got a nice round snare. That should suffice. Alright. Now down in this choke point here. Now, if you look down there, it should be all right. Go.
unfortunately doesn't seem to be any rabbits in this spot even though it's a good looking spot oh well move on to the next pocket answer my phone apparently All right, so just set six snares today. Didn't find a, near as many good pass as I expected, but uh, if everything goes well, uh, hope maybe to pick up a couple rabbits tomorrow when I come. Two would be perfect. Got to redo the, the ground rabbit burger video that I was supposed to have out for you folks. I uh, did the video, but uh, some of the footage is corrupted, so I'm going to redo that and show you how we make out with that. And uh, anyway, I'm going to head back to the Jeep, come back tomorrow and see if we got anything. Stay tuned. All right, so I found another little gem of a pass, so set up another snare on that. So I think I have eight out so far. That should suffice. Anyway, we'll have a look around, see if there's a couple more on our way out that we could set. Otherwise, we'll head home and come back tomorrow. Hey folks, it's the morning of day two. Just in, uh, back in here, gonna check the snares and see how we made out. The temperature did come up some yesterday afternoon after I left. It came up above zero, so hopefully the snares didn't uh, end up being too high. So we're gonna take a walk back in and see if we got anything and uh, make a decision whether we leave them for another day or so. We do have more warm weather coming, so might be wise to bring them up and then uh, retry in a few days once we get the cold weather back. But we'll make that decision as we go. So uh, come along with me and we'll see if uh, we had any luck. Just having a look around to see where I put snares. What the danger was okay well at minimum that one will have to be reset okay one there and then another one over here somewhere i didn't hit that path all right Looks like snare number two was a lot more successful by the looks. Look at that.
GoPro. All right, folks, well, I've checked all the snares. Uh, I've had a few ruined by uh, the warm weather yesterday afternoon. Kind of expected that when I seen the temperature come up. These last two, one set all right, the other one fell down, so uh, can't do much about that. It didn't look like there was a rabbit through here anyway, so uh, we will uh, pick them up. Hopefully with our one rabbit, we didn't quite make our goal, but hopefully with the one rabbit, we can make a couple burgers out of that and uh, get that video that I started up before Christmas out to you folks. But until next time, I'm Gary from Nova Scotia Act Fisher Outdoors. Get out there and explore the woods, enjoy the winter months, and we'll see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye. Okay, Mr. Snare, time for you to go. GoPro. All right, so, see here. Get my shadows in the way, but looks like along with this one up here. Three deer moved through the field last night or early this morning. Good to see. Keep an eye on them for my scouting for next year. Awesome.